35 millimeter. 35 millimeter nut on this uh, Ford Explorer for the rear wheel bearing uh, right there. And then just a couple 10 millimeter nuts. Hold the caliper on, get the caliper out of the way. And then we're gonna keep going on here. to where they're not going to pull threads. And then Yankee. See how it slides right out with the slide hammer? Not really. We'll come back to this. Yes. You know what size this is here? It was? Uh, it's the, yeah, it's the 18 millimeter. By 18 millimeter nut. 18 or 3 quarter inch. Uh, get that baby off there. And of course we got this nut off here and this bolt here. It's a 18 and a 13 sixteenths or 21. 18 and 13 sixteenths or 21. Then you got this one out too. And uh, just using a chisel in here, chisel in there, it will help separate separate them and the uh, ball joints should come free with a little uh, hammering. And then we have this out. Snap ring there. Probably would. Yeah, there's a snap ring in there. No, it's up to you if you're going to try and bang this out. Or at this point, maybe you just take it to a machine shop and they can press a new bearing in and out for you for the do-it-yourselfer. Just uh, compress this spring and get this off here and just set this all free and take it somewhere and have it done. I think that's going to be best for you. Otherwise, take the snap ring out and then bang that baby out and bang a new one in. This is for a 2004 Ford Explorer rear wheel bearing.